Hey, welcome back. Well, new here at 10, we have an update to a story that we first brought you back in March. A 10 year old boy from Fort Smith is currently on his way to Washington, D.C. for the National Spelling Bee. If you want something bad enough, you'll work hard for every day, even on weekends. I also study. He studies the dictionary, several word lists, and I've also been studying vocab words and everything because he plans to accomplish his goal. I can finally achieve my dream of going to being a national speller. This Tuesday, he's representing Woods Elementary, Fort Smith. But now I'm going to have to represent like the whole state of Arkansas. So. It's kind of pressuring. Pressuring, but also a privilege. A privilege in order to represent everyone and everything you care about in the state that you just love. Tuesday, he'll compete against more than 200 other spellers from all 50 states. And this can create lifelong friendships that will last a lifetime. And he's looking to make a lifetime of memories. I've always wanted to go to Washington, D.C. for actual a cause. And he'll be representing the state of Arkansas while there. But remember, he's still 10 years old. Looking forward to visiting Legolands if I can. And if so, I'm going to Gaylord as well. And I'm also going to get go to the National Mall of D.C. But no matter what happens in D.C., he knows he can always count on the love and support from our Kansans. I appreciate all of Fort Smith supporting me, cheering me on. Now, Zeeshan told me that he and his family should land in D.C. tomorrow night. And the National Spelling Bee starts on Tuesday, so we certainly wish him the best of luck. That's my little guy right there.